Hey guys, how's it going? Paul here from Content Academy and this is a very short periscope, so it's my first one actually, so let's call it the Paul Scope and really what I'm talking about is how you can improve your blog, get more people to your blog and take away three steps from UFC as to how you can actually improve how you blog by giving people what they actually want. So step one is fairly simple, fairly straightforward. Ask talk to people whether it's talking to your followers on twitter whether it's talking to followers on facebook in a facebook community uh, or whether it's face to face with people who you know are into your content talk to them what do they want what do they want to see what do they want to know i mean look ufc what do we all want to see we want to see the best fight so sometimes ufc doesn't follow the typical sports based um i suppose system of rankings they put together the fights to which the audience most wants so you need to take that same uh, attitude into your uh, blog when you're actually putting together your content the second piece is once you've actually you know you've collated all of that information you need to actually store it somewhere, you know, whether it's in OneNote, which is what I use, uh, or any other application. Make sure you, you store it somewhere safe so that you actually have it. And what's quite interesting is when you put all the different pieces of content together, you actually get to see uh, a lot of trends. And that should give you a lot of ideas on, on content which you can put together. Uh, most importantly, you're giving people content that they want, which would also ultimately maximize how, how well your blog should do. So um, that's obviously very, very important. Um, I suppose the third step, um, keeping this nice and short as promised, is, you know, use that content which you've collated, use those ideas which people have given you and actually put together 50 blog posts, so put 50 ideas together from that. Um, now, if you can't get to 50, you either haven't done enough research or else, you know, you're not passionate enough or, or that, that niche is not quite for you. Um, but having said that, I mean, you should have no problems getting to that number. It sounds like a lot, but when you sit down and put a couple of hours into it, all of a sudden you'll be there with the content very, very quickly. Um, so I suppose to recap talk to your followers, find out what they want, have those honest conversations. Secondly, Put it all together somewhere safe. I use Microsoft OneNote uh, as the location where I store all of, of my research uh, that I collect. And then the third thing is to actually put it, uh, put it all together and create some blog post ideas. Uh, and really, ultimately, if you can give your audience what they want or your prospective audience what they want, you should ultimately end up having a lot more success. So this was day one of a 30-day challenge between myself and Phil. Thanks, everybody, for having a look at this a periscope and if you've watched the replay thank you very much for tuning in uh, i will talk to you i'll be back again soon